Are you looking for outdoor games to play with your kids? My mom got our kids this thing right here. I wanna to talk to you guys about it today because we have it kinda of set up in the backyard. We're gonna get into that in this review. First of all, hi. Hi to all the new dads out there. This is Dad Reviews. This is where I give you my unedited, hopefully more authentic look at the products that we like, use, and have. And my mom gives to our kids for Easter. <laughs> so if you're interested in that, you might wanna consider clicking that subscribe button. So what we have here is Flarts. It's the Floor Dart Game by Giggle and Go. I'll link them up down in the description below if you guys care to check it out. But uh, basically they give you these three darts right here and uh, they're, they're blow up so you blow, actually look, come on, let's go outside and let me show it to you. You blow them up and the bottom, the white part on it, see the white part there? It's, it has a little bit of a weight to it. And then you, uh, you have this mat that you put on the ground. It's basically a big giant target board. And uh, once you have the target board on the ground, you take your darts and you throw them at the target. The problem is that the target, this happens to it. It just kind of gets stuck in the leaves here. So you got it. we haven't really found a good place for it yet because whenever you're out here playing it, you know, you're gonna spread it out and you gotta take up some grass area. And then whenever you uh, need to mow your lawn, uh, the kids don't seem to pick it up. And that's a problem because <laughs> you gotta mow your lawn. <laughs> So this is the dart, tar, uh, dart target right here. It has, just like a dart board, numbers all the way around, different uh, variables there. And then you, of course you have your bullseye in the middle there. And then what you do is you take your dart, which is this thing right here. It looks like a little torpedo kind of thing. Nice big bulky thing so little kids can, can grab it. Even our one year old can actually grab this which shows you kind of how easy it is for them to grab which is also good. And like I said on the bottom here, it's got, I don't know what's inside there. It kind of feels like sand. That's what I'm assuming is in there. But uh, it does give it a little bit of weight so that this actually uh, you know angles downward to hit. Now it does have a little bit of a jump to it so whenever it hits the ground it's gonna bounce. And so that's what makes this game actually quite complicated for both kids and adults. I'm gonna go ahead and do a little tester. Oh, it does also come with these little uh, stakes right here. It's just some little orange stakes. They're plastic. They have a good head on them, which is nice. You can easily uh, put your hand on it to like press it into the ground and you won't hurt the palm of your hand that much whenever you go to press. Or you could take like a simple soft mallet to it or something to help, uh, to help get it into the ground. But that is one thing that's nice that they give you in case the wind's blowing or something like that. So let me go ahead and show y'all the flarts. So we have our dartboard right there, and I'm just gonna simply take this, boom, and see how it gives it bounces. It gives a good bounce, so you gotta kinda really uh, work like making it go up so that it comes down and it doesn't bounce as much. That's kind of the technique that I've learned, because if you kinda throw it out at it like you would normal darts, you're just gonna get that bounce way off to the side. But like I said, super fun game if you wanna get your kids outside into the, some sunshine and uh, really just having some fun outside, especially in the summertime. You know what this is gonna be fun with? Whenever it, it, we get wet, like we set up the slip and slide or the pool outside and all that and we put this thing out, because all this is just like a rubber material, you know, plastic material, whatever. So whenever it gets all wet, put some suds on there, make it a little bit harder to try and get it. Now, another thing that we like about this game is if we if something happens to this mat, uh, it's not the end of the world because these things are super fun to just take and chunk at your kids. They actually go quite far as well because they have that weight in there. And so me and Jacques, we just have fun playing uh, dodge darts <laughs> instead of dodgeball. But uh, just to give you an idea of how far I can throw it whenever I give it kind of all, uh, all my aim, all my momentum, all my whatever you want to call it, we're going to do it here. I mean, that's that's good way across the yard, at least 20 to 25, maybe even 30 feet all the way across the yard. So uh, super fun to play with your kids, whether you're actually aiming at the dartboard, if you want to do it fun outside in the rain or the sunshine, or if you just want to peg each other with darts, they give you three of them so you can just kind of go back and forth with them, which is super fun. Another th game that we played with it, with the mat, is we just played whoever is the first one to get the bullseye wins. And so we're all standing over this thing, just trying to drop it on. It's actually harder than that, usually. I just happened to get it right there the first time because they usually bounce off, and I was super close too, but standing a little further away, 
Ah, oh, dang it. So if you guys want to check this out, again, it's called Flarts. I'll link it up down in the description below. Y'all can go read other people's reviews about it. Don't just take my word for it. If you're looking for other outdoor activities that you can do with your kids, though, I'm going to put some right there on the screen. You guys go click those videos. I'll see y'all in those videos. Thank you, dads, for watching. That thumbs up is appreciated, and dad out.